Country CEO back in the house again. Man, look, Mo Game. Mo Game and Mo Game. That's right. That's what I got for you. Pure, unadulterated, uncut game. Look, welcome back to the channel. Member subscribers. Man, I'm just excited in the lab on this beautiful day. Matter of fact, you just want to know, Country CEO, what day that was using the lab? Look, this is the day after Thanksgiving. This is the Friday after Thanksgiving, right? And I'm in here grinding it out for you guys to give you the best that I have to offer, right? So look, got another good one for the day. Look, load up on fluids and filters. You hear me? Those of you who are in the business, those of you getting ready to get into the business, load up on fluids and filters. Country CEO, why you say that? There's a shortage going on of fluids and filters. Recently, I was informed a couple weeks ago, you better start buying your stuff in bulk because there's a shortage going on on death fluid, oil, everything, right? Well, you know, me, a lot of stuff going on and slipped by me. I normally get my stuff from Tractor Supply, that death fluid, Traveler death fluid, five gallon buckets, right? Go there, boom, no five gallon buckets. Guy tells me truck coming in that next Monday. I wait till that Monday, boom, truck don't show up, truck shows up, ain't got none on that, right? So I said, okay, I see what I better do. So AutoZone locally have it, but they're a little higher, but I had to go ahead and get it, right? But what I did was those boxes, tra uh, truck, Tractor Supply did have, so I got me several of those. So I had to go ahead and load up, all right, and then... Uh, I'm going to try to order online see can I get the five-gallon bucket, but I'm telling you now, load up on your fluids, your death fluid, all right? Uh, that's the first thing, right? If your truck is on death, load up on that death fluid. Sometimes we have the uh, uh, feeling of, I ain't finna spend money uh, too soon that I don't have to spend, but I'm telling you, you're going to use the death fluid. <laughs> you know, there's no doubt about it. You're going to use it, right? And it ain't going to be long that you're going to use it. So it's not like this stuff going to sit on your shelf for months at a time you're going to use it. Load up on the oil and your oil filters and your air filters, right? You don't know next time that dealership, they running shortage now, right? They they came get their stuff in on time, right? So if they got the oil and the oil filters and the air filters, man, look, go ahead and get that stuff. Get you an extra pair of everything is what I'm advising people. Get you an extra pair of everything. Even though you know you only, you finna change all, get a pair of filter kit for this time, get a filter kit for next time. Our filter, get one for this time, go ahead and get one for next time. I'm telling you, this stuff is crazy out here now with these shortages, right? All right, not only all filters, air filters, uh, your all, but hydraulic fluid, right? We know that these trucks use hydraulic, all hydraulic fluid for our cylinders uh, and things of that nature, power steering or whatever you use hydraulic in that or whatever, or whatever you use hydraulic for. Load up on hydraulic fluid, right? Pretty much a five-gallon bucket will do you pretty good because we don't use it for a whole lot of things, mostly that cylinder. If you ain't got a leak, you're not losing it, using it all that fast, okay? All right, gear oil. You already know your transmission, your, your rear end, they use gear oil. Load up on gear oil, man. Get you an extra uh, set of that stuff as well, right? And then finally, grease. Load up on grease, man. Crazy as it is. Joker's running out of grease right here, man. What's really going on? All right, and so look, that's the game. Load up on your filters and your fluids because you just don't know what's really going on. I would hate to see you miss a day of work fooling around behind some oil or some death fluid or filter or some craziness like that, right? All right, so I'm just giving you game about what I'm doing myself. I'm doing the same thing because until things get back to normal, we don't know when that's going to be. You got to do what you got to do to make sure nothing as simple and as small as that prevents you from going out there and making $800 to $1,000 a day in this dump truck business. Look, this video has been valuable to you. Hit the like, hit the subscribe, hit the uh, notification bell, share this video about the game that the country CEO has given you. Look, don't play around with it, man. Load up on fluids and filters. Until times get better, country CEO, I'm out of here, I'm gone.